This is indefinite integration problem which has x multiplied by x square minus 1 in the denominator and it is one of my personal favorite questions. Of course, we can uh, use the classical approach of partial fractions to solve this question, but let us take a different route today. Because exploring new methods deepens our conceptual understanding. So, I am trying a new method today. Let us take x square common out of the bracket. First term has x square, so this becomes 1. But second term does not have x square, so this becomes 1 upon x square. So, that when we multiply, back multiply this x square by the bracket, we get the original term only. Now, in the denominator, we have x cube. And bracket term can be written as 1 minus x raised to power minus 2. Now, we will use method of substitution. Put 1 minus x raised to power minus 2 is equal to t on differentiating both sides with respect to x. Derivative of 1 is 0, negative. Then minus 2 comes before x and it becomes x raised to power minus 2 minus 1 which is minus 3 dx is equal to dt. So, this minus plus minus into minus becomes positive sign. So, this becomes 2 divided by x cube dx is equal to dt. So, we get 1 upon x cube dx is equal to half dt. Now, let us substitute the values. So, our integral becomes dx divided by x cube is half dt. Half we will write outside the integral sign and dt. 1 upon this bracket is t only. So, this is dt upon t and its integral is natural log mod t plus c. When we back substitute the value of t, we get half ln mod 1 minus 1 upon x square plus c. Let us simplify a bit and take LCM in the bracket. So, this becomes x square minus 1 upon x square. So, the answer is half ln mod x square minus 1 upon x square plus c.